The choke controls cold engine startup. There are two adjustments on an electric choke. You can control the choke operation by rotating the choke cap. Notice there is a center pointer and index marks on the choke mounting and an index mark on the thermostatic choke caps. Inside the choke cap is a heating element. When the ignition key is switched on, the bimetal heating element unwinds and opens the choke. If the choke is opening too soon and causing a difficult cold start, loosen the three choke cap locking screws and rotate the choke cap counterclockwise one notch at a time until the choke operation is satisfactory. Rotate the choke cap clockwise if the choke comes open too late. You'll need to let the engine cool between changing settings. Do not adjust the choke cap beyond the index marks. Doing so will damage the internals of the electric choke unit. Make sure to check the wire running to the positive terminal of the choke housing. This wire should be connected to a switched source that shows 12 volts with the ignition key turned on and no voltage when the ignition is off. The only other adjustment on the electric choke controls the engine's idle RPM during cold startup. A cold engine by nature needs to idle at a higher RPM until it's warmed up. The adjustment that controls the RPMs is the fast idle cam. When the accelerator pedal is pushed to the floor before a cold engine startup, the fast idle cam holds the primary throttle plates open a bit more than usual to raise the idle RPMs during warm-up. The fast idle cam also has a series of steps on the cam that will step down the engine's idle RPM until the choke plate is fully open. The fast idle speed is set at the factory and should give you about 1500 to 1600 RPM at cold startup. In most cases, you won't need to make adjustments. If your engine requires a higher idle speed or is not idling around 1600 RPM at startup, you'll want to adjust the fast idle screw. To make the adjustment, turn the engine off and let it cool until the choke is fully closed. With the engine off, push the throttle to its wide open position and hold it there. This will expose the fast idle set screw from behind the choke housing. Using a quarter inch open end wrench, turn the screw clockwise to increase the RPM or counterclockwise to decrease the RPM. Close the throttle, restart the engine, and check your engine RPM. Adjust as many times as needed until the engine idles well from a cold start until fully warmed up. Also, keep an eye out for your adjustment screw rubbing against or contacting your intake manifold just below the carburetor base. Correct this clearance if needed.